Will home prices drop because of the pandemic? What do the experts say? Stay tuned and find out. Welcome to Sarasota Homes. We release new videos like this every week, so like, subscribe, and hit that little bell so that you're notified when we release new content. Will home prices fall because of the pandemic? I know that's on a lot of people's minds, and our clients have been asking the same question. Now, you can go on the internet and find all kinds of doomsayers that will tell you the sky is falling, and this is just like 2008. But let's take a look at what the experts say. The first thing we want to consider is how does this compare to the 2008 housing bubble? Well, it's a completely different situation. Back then, there were internal forces in the market that caused it to implode. This time, it's external forces, the pandemic, that's influencing both the housing market and the economy in general. I wrote an article about this that's extensive, and it's in our first quarter 2020 market update. I put a link to that in the description, so go ahead and get that and learn more about how the two situations compare. So what are the experts saying? I've put links to that also in the description for Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac, and others. Everybody seems to agree that housing prices are going to flatten throughout 2020. This is not that different than what we predicted back at the end of 2019, but definitely we will see housing prices flatten. Not necessarily fall a lot, but definitely flatten. But just as important, we expect home sales to remain about the same as they were at this time last year. Uh, right now, of course, in the current market, we're seeing less activity, less homes coming on the market, less homes going under contract. But then again, we put a home under contract this weekend and at a very good price. So are locally, are people reducing the prices of their homes? No, they're not. And when they're listing homes during this period, they're listing them at about the same price they would have without the pandemic. Buyers, they're still paying about 95% of asking price, which is normal. So we're not seeing currently anyway, we're not seeing an adverse effect of the pandemic on home prices. And according to the experts that I've listed below, they also don't see that in the near future. Okay, so what does this mean to you if you're buying or selling a home? If you've currently put your home on the market, leave it there, that's my advice. Should you drop the price? Not because of the pandemic. If you need to sell your home or you've overpriced it, then yeah, drop the price. But your situation is unique and I can't give you blanket advice. What I would say is don't panic and don't drop the price just because it's been on the market a while. The stigma that we usually see for homes being left on the market for a long period of time without selling, I think is going to be adjusted in buyers' minds because they know that homes are sitting there because of the pandemic. So I wouldn't jump to reduce your price. If you're thinking about putting your home on the market, then you need to consider, well, should I do it now or should I wait for things to clear up a bit? Your situation, again, is unique, but I wouldn't be afraid to put your home on the market. Right now, there are less homes on the market, so you have less competition. If you wait until the pandemic lifts, well, you may find yourself with more competition. And since buyers are still paying fair market value, I don't know that you have much to lose, but I'd talk to your realtor to get good advice for your local area. Okay, so what about buyers? Should you start looking now or should you wait for the pandemic to lift? Well, home prices are stable. We don't think they're gonna drop. So if you find a home that you love right now, I'd buy it and pay fair market value for it. Don't think you're gonna get bargain basement prices. Yeah, here and there, a seller may reduce their price because they really need to sell. But in general, prices aren't moving and we don't think they're gonna move sharply downward anytime in the future. So if you find something you like, buy it and pay a fair market value. Now, if you wait, well, you're gonna be in competition just like home sellers that are waiting to put their homes on the market. So again, my advice is look, if you see something, buy it, pay fair market value. Okay, check out the links in the description to see what the experts say. I also have a link to an article that I wrote that goes into a lot more detail. You make the decision that's best for you. Only you know your particular situation. Until we see you next time, Stay safe and stay at home.